picture. Homelessness. Yeah. Homelessness is a terrible problem. Is it alcohol? Yeah. Hey. 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 Come here, man. Look. Homelessness. I can't talk about it on my lunch hour. Alcohol, <laughs> alcohol problems? No. Drug problems? No. Mental they, issues? None. Or they just need a good boot up the arse? Uh, all Which one is All it? of them. All of them? Sure, for all the people because there's so many different problems that different people have. They're not, but some of them have them all. So how, why not all of them? How much is it connected mental illness to addictions? You want to get this on no, camera? No, 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 yeah, I want, this I want to interview this is the, the public. This is the post interview from her pre interview. Yeah, exactly. Go ahead. Oh, cool. Um, can be all. Can be all? <laughs> yeah, and some of them are just aliens. And they sort of like to walk along the street so snow it. Yeah, just like we see here. We're trying to educate, but we're being distracted. Oh, uh, that's okay. There oh, yeah. you go again. They want, they want some wine. If, I don't, the if I don't say something, I'll, I'll be labeled I got ADHD or something. But seriously. Yeah, but seriously, I mean, all different people, different things, right? And some people have them all. Mental health issues, a lot of people have depression, anxiety, those kinds of things, and the tendency is to self-medicate. Sometimes you do it for so long that addiction kicks in. So, which comes first, chicken or the egg? Sometimes people have an addictive personality, if that's how you use that term, and they over-medicate so much that they end up with a mental health issue. It goes both ways. How? What, what's, the, what's the worst part of all of this? Poverty. Poverty. Poverty is the worst. If we turn around, I get, how? I get paid for saying that. <laughs> Friday. And you, you want a bottle of wine? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> how? I stopped drinking this morning. By the way, somebody gave me this and they just happened to be here. Yeah. Okay. We're not promoting not drinking promoting out drinking the out in the hallway. But, no. the, but the problem is, how does the government do this? The government doesn't. They don't. I mean, that's, that's, that is the problem. That is the problem. The government doesn't handle it. They try to handle everything on an individual basis. <coughs> and uh, they do a poor job of it because they have so many different people that don't know what to do. That's because they don't know what the problem is. So, when the government, when they talk about affordable housing, is affordable yeah. housing the issue? That's all they yeah. talk. When they talk about this problem, they say, well, affordable housing, like behind us. So somebody is moving, moving, yeah. and that's good. And, but it's from affordable yeah. housing the yeah. issue. It's not the issue, yeah. but it, it, yeah. it, it, certainly, solution. Solution. it certainly is a big step towards the solution. Because yeah. what they don't say is a big key word, and it's stability. So I've got a place. I can. I know where I'm going to lay my head. I don't have to worry about it. I don't have to be concerned about you know how I'm going to get this, how I'm going to get that, where I'm going to go. That's that, that's a big key. Stability issue that gives you a place. And once you've got the place, then you can work on all the other stuff. That that's, that works for me. It works in my mind, and I've seen it work. At least 20 people every year are doing done all the good. Sell. 20 people every year since the last four years that I've been doing this stuff. At least. 20 and help. Yeah, 20 and help. There may be 37 that we put into places, but 20 of them are going to succeed and do better. And that, you can't ask for anything more. They may have issues five years from now, but you know, something else. Like Parker passes away, or mom or dad passes away, or kids pass away. That's, you know, that's going to influence how they may do it in society, right? And if you have a problem like this in Cardigan, you can just imagine what's going on in Monkley yeah, and St. John. Everywhere, yeah, yeah. I've been trying to have coffee with Blaine Hayes. It looks like there's no more communication with the Premier. And he should really take a walk down Cape Street oh, yeah. and Queen Street to educate himself on what's going on. Yeah. Yeah. Should, but again, what can a minister do when they've got a whole department of the No, no, but what can a minister do? So, I mean, the minister's report up to, to the premier, yeah. right? So the minister should be doing a lot first, maybe, maybe more of the premier. Mike, if you don't mind, we're going to have this conversation again, but there's no distraction, no snowballs, and no noise behind I us. I can't believe it. I have to do it again. So I have three interviews. I'm no good until I've been talked to three times. That sounds about right. All good. Keep up the good work, Mike. Thanks.